def it's, it's definitely, um, it, at first it was like exciting, the, the most fun thing I ever did, but uh, as it goes on, you get tired, your body is it's just real fatigue. You just got to push yourself through it, stay, stay mentally strong the whole time. But it was definitely a, a good journey. Is it everything that you were expecting? Did you? Uh, yeah, it was, uh, it was a little more than I expected, actually, as far as, far as um, the, like, how tired I am, you know, I didn't expect to be this tired. What do you know about the Kings in this team? Uh, you know, I don't, I don't, I don't know much about the Kings, but you know, I know that it's definitely a young team with a young, uh, young core, and I know they they play hard, and they like to play fast, and it's kind of the game I want to play. How do you think you'd fit in with this roster? Uh, I actually think I fit in well. You know, they have a, uh, they have good guards, and they also have a good big man with Demarcus Cousins. You know, they got uh, Tyreek Evans, Jimmer, Isaiah Thomas. You know, uh, they really, uh, they don't really have someone in that three, in that three spot. What's, what kind of feedback have you gotten from teams in terms of what you need to improve as you progress to the next level? Uh, you know, everything was really positive feedback. You know, um, like they said, uh, I got to get stronger, but that's going to come with age. You know, um, just keep working on everything I've been working on, like my ball handling, my shot, you know, my speed. Where are you coming along with your ball handling right now? What was that? Where are you coming along with your ball handling? Uh, I think it's getting better. You know, um, I've been working a lot on it ever since season ended, and uh, it's definitely improving. Just trying to get better at going left too. Yeah, that's a. Uh, I mean, uh, for one, like two weeks straight, I just was working on just my left hand, so it definitely benefited me. Can you discuss your, your your work on your jump shot in terms of what you're doing to improve that and develop that? Uh, just I think it's a lot of repetition. You know, um, I think I have a, a nice stroke, so uh, it's really just getting shots up and getting more reps. Was it confidence that last year at St. John's that kind of led you to shoot just you know 20 percent, around 20 percent from from three? Or? No, I think it was just uh, rushing a lot of shots. You know, I didn't, and then uh, after at one point in the season, I, did, I stopped shooting them because uh, they weren't going in. So I can't do that, and I just got to keep working. Do you think this process would kind of allow people to maybe see more of what you could do than they might have saw when you were in college? Oh uh, yeah, definitely. Because I didn't really shoot the ball well at all in college, and um, going to these workouts, I got a chance to showcase my jump shot. Showcase my ball handling, and just showcase how hard I play. This is what the coaches, watching what the coach was going through last year. What did that just do for you guys as a group, kind of dealing with adversity and still having to go out there and play? Uh, man, the whole season was really a learning experience, and um, not having Coach Lavin there, we really, um, we had to just stay strong and stay together. And I think that that helped us grow up faster than uh, everybody expected us to. You know, we were all freshmen, and uh, we really took a blow, but we stayed strong.